Hey, thanks for joining us again this week. I'm so excited to have you. We're going to talk about another great group of horses coming up on our Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sale. Take your notes. Remember when you're taking notes, write questions down because you can call me and I'll answer those questions for you. That's all coming up right here on Discovering the Horseman Within. Gonna take a ride on one true Throughout history, a cowboy's horse has been there for more than just the miles. He's a partner in everything they do. Renowned trainer Ken McNabb invites you to find your perfect equine partner at this year's 14th annual Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sale, June 4th at the Powderhorn Ranch in Douglas, Wyoming. Each of the horses has been trained to handle all that the rugged Wyoming landscape can offer, making them a horse for every purpose and level of rider. Go to dmhorses.com for more details and videos. And don't miss this year's Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sale. Hip number 42, Ringo. Here is a 2020 Buckskin Stud Colt. If you are looking for that special horse, Ringo is your guy. His pedigree is full of AQHA legends. Uh, I have started so many of this Colt's siblings that I actually went and bought his sire to add to our breeding program for a couple of years. This is an incredible uh, stud colt with a ton of cow bred into him. He, his mother is an own daughter of Yellowrona, Texas. This horse will get down in front of a cow or get up and run to one and let you rope off of him one of these days. He'll be anything you want him to be. More importantly, uh, he's got that quiet disposition and great confirmation that makes incredible horses. That's hip number 42, Ringo. Hip number 43, Robber. Robber is a 2016 model bay gelding. Robber was born and raised on the Powderhorn Ranch. He stands 14.3 and weighs 1,250 pounds. He is registered as DLL Robin Royalty. He is sired by our late great son of Highbrow Cat and out of an own daughter of Royal Fletch. This horse has more cow in him than the average cow. Uh, what an incredibly bred horse an athlete, a gentle disposition. Robert is a quality young horse with a great disposition and a good mind. Ever since his two-year-old year, he has come back solid and gentle with time off and eager to please. He's comfortable with all sorts of terrain, steep trails, snow drifts, rocks, ice, whatever it is, he's handled it. He's been swimming, he's been trail ridden, wherever you want to take him, he's got a great handle. This is a home-raised horse we're super proud of. That is hip number 43, Robber. Hip number 44, Carmen. This is a 2014 Sorrel mare. She is grade. I absolutely love this mare. This is a sweet, sweet mare. What a handle, what a disposition. Uh, I was in shock the first time I looked up and saw Kurt come riding into the branding pen with a neck rope and no bridle on. He's hauled her to multiple brandings, different styles of brandings. Uh, the last branding he hauled her to, they rode all day. He didn't even take a bridle with him. Uh, it was a big gather in a big pasture. He gathered all day and then roped on her. This is one neat horse. She is kind and gentle. The best thing I can say about her is that Dee Dee got on and rode her and said, oh my word, I love that mare. She rode her for an afternoon job. She came back, she said, wow, do I love that mare. That is a really neat horse. Uh, this is probably one of my favorite horses that Kurt's ever ridden for me. Uh, the job he's done on this horse, we bought a really neat horse and he just continued to let her be a rock star and take her to the next level. This is a really cool individual. Hip number 44, Carmen.
Tip number 45, Casino. This is a 2014 model Palomino Gelding. He's a super ranch horse for the whole family. He's trustworthy and steady in every situation you put him in. He's seen many miles on the ranch from checking fence to gathering and trailing cows. He's been ridden by all kinds of people from beginners to advanced. Everybody that rides him loves him. Casino's gone through the mounted patrol obstacle course and nothing seems to phase him. He's excellent to bathe, clip, and shoe. If you're looking for a great one, Casino is your horse. My favorite Casino story is uh, we every year we do a program with the United States Marine Corps from the Intermountain uh, Warfare Training Center. They brought Marines this year who had never been horseback. I put one of those guys on this horse and watched him go from an inexperienced rider to a man that handled playing games at speed and had a great time. And this horse did his job well. That's hip number 45, Casino. Hip number 46, Cedar. This is a 2013 model Red Dun Gelding. He's absolutely solid, gentle gelding with an all-around ability. He's finished in the arena with NRHA earnings and has all the handle you could ask for, including easy lope departures, flying lead changes, spins and sliding stops. He's well-rounded outside of the arena and is fun to gather pastures on, running the saddle horses or trail ride. Cedar has a smooth way of moving and is easy to ride one-handed. He rides off alone without a fuss and is excellent with time off and likes attention without being nosy. He can tune up like a fiddle, but he doesn't have to ride fancy to be happy. He'll gladly be your friend and just take a bareback trail ride or pull the kids on the sled. This has been one really cool horse that Haley has really enjoyed riding. Hip number 46, Cedar. Hip number 47, Mater. This is a 2017 model brown gelding. He stands 14 one hands and 1,000 pounds. He is registered in the AQHA as King Cole's Reeser. Mater was purchased by Cooper as a three-year-old to be his 4-H project. This handy-sized gelding has the most trustworthy, gentle nature and just wants to please his riders. Mater was started as a cutter, so has a fancy handle, but would much rather be used on the trail or out on the ranch. Cooper's used him the last two years for calving, branding, and moving cattle. Mater has also packed elk this last year and took everything in stride. There are no surprises from him with time off. Just saddle up and go for a ride. Mater meets you at the gate every time and always does whatever is asked of him. That's hip number 47, Mater. Hip number 48, Lily. She's registered in the AQHA as Lily Smart Peach. Her height is 14 two hands and 1,025 pounds. There are so many things to tell you that I love about Lily that it's hard for me to pick which one it is. I've watched this little horse take a hard jerk on the saddle horn from livestock that weighed more than she did. And she never falters, never cares. She is good in any situation. She's been to the branding pen, she's been to the pasture, and she's been up and down the trail. You're not gonna show her something she hasn't seen. This is a mare with uh, an athletic way of being and a good level of energy. Uh, absolutely a kind horse in every way. That is hip number 48, Lily. Hip number 50, Johnny. Johnny is a 2013 model Palomino Gelding, stands 14 three hands and 1,100 pounds, and is registered in the AQHA as Circles Round Sioux. Johnny is stout and handsome Palomino Gelding with a phenomenal pedigree, an own son of Shiner named Sioux, who is by the famous $10 million sire Shining Spark. 
Johnny has a big smooth stop and easy transitions. This horse is so kind and gentle in definition of a true gentleman. He's always reliable, will go all day, works a rope very well, drags calves and can take you through rough terrain. He will not disappoint you. Johnny is the kind that every ranch hand wants to ride. That's hip number 50, Johnny. Hip number 51, Slate. This is a 2016 model gray gelding. He stands 15 one hands and 1180 pounds of gorgeous gray horse. He is registered in the AQHA as Eddie's Jack Spratt. Slate is Mr. Dependable. He's one of the most quiet and steady horses you could ever ask to ride. As a six year old, he acts like a 12 year old. He's a favorite, rather we are moving cows, wrangling horses or just out for a leisurely trail ride. He has no problem riding out alone, crosses ditches, creeks, and snowdrifts without hesitation. Slate has been safe and careful with timid riders, and I would trust him to take care of anyone I put on his back. He is always eager to please, and I have never seen him look twice at an obstacle. He does great with time off and is easy to ride with a great neck rein and a soft mouth and solid stops off your seat. Just a kind, easy, gentle gelding. That's hip number 51, Slate. Hip number 52, Boone. This is a 2017 model five-year-old gelding. He is 14 three hands and 1150 pounds of cool horse. He is by once in a blue Boone, a great son of Pepta Boone's Mall, and he is out of an own daughter of highbrow cat. I love the way this horse is bred and it shows up in every single ride. Ah, this has been a really cool horse, I've used him for everything I can think of. The boys started using him after I broke my leg last year. I came back to using him. He is absolutely a fantastic gelding. Tons of handle. Any job you want to do from dragging calves to the fire to tagging out in the field to trail riding, uh, he's ready to go. You want to take him and show him in the AQHA shows, in the ranch versatility shows, in the ranch reining, the ranch riding, uh, the cow work. It doesn't matter where you want to go with him. This is a really neat horse that absolutely fits uh, the rider you put on his back. He is a good, kind, gentle gelding. That is hip number 52, Boone. Hip number 53, Stetson. This is a 2016 gray gelding. He stands 14 three hands and 1,050 pounds. He is registered in the AQHA as Playguns Paladin. This is a cool, pretty gray Playgun bred horse. What a nice horse. It sounds corny, but Stetson truly has the disposition and ability to go anywhere from here. He always seems to have soft eye and ears pricked forward and his head set square on his shoulders. He has an easy feel and a nice way in the arena. One of my master certified trainers rode him. She used him to finish her master's test. He has done everything from pulling Christmas trees out of the snow uh, to having cattle roped off of him with dogs barking at his heels. Uh, this horse is absolutely willing to do whatever job you put him up to. He is the type of horse that many riders will enjoy. He's happy to be your trail buddy, working ranch horse, arena Cadillac, or all of the above. That is hip number 53, Stetson. Hip number 54, Wally. 
Wally is a uh, 2014 model red dun gelding. He is grade. This horse has been there and done it all for us. We have used him uh, from our three week master trainer program all the way through the Trail Rider Universities. Anything you want to do, this is a big stout eight year old horse uh, who can do the job you put in front of him. He's 15 hands, 1100 pounds of athletic, kind, willing disposition. Donald Archer's had this horse with him and has trail ridden him all over the Blue Ridge Mountains. This horse has never seen anything there that bothered him. He didn't see anything here on the ranch all summer. We had him here all summer, all winter. Donald took him home back in February to ride him this spring and North Carolina fit him just as good as Wyoming. Anywhere you want to put him, hip number 54, Wally. Hip number 55, Noodles. Noodles is a 2016 model Palomino gelding. He is 15 hands and 1,100 pounds of awful pretty Palomino gelding. He is registered as Champagne Gold Peppy. The Houck family, they've owned him since he was a yearling. He's as special a horse as you'll ever find. I will confidently say I would trust him with any rider. His resume hauled to several states, several thousands of miles of trail riding, ridden at countless state and national parks. He's ridden among the wild horses in Arizona and at the trail classes at the junior rodeos all across the country. We've roped a lot of cattle in the arena and pasture. He's carried the flag at lots of national anthems, and we have put news reporters and local celebrities on him for promotional events. Pete says he's put his handicapped wife and little kids and his 70-year-old mom have all ridden noodles. This horse has been there and done that. If you look at him, you're looking at a horse that is six years old and been in the same family since he was a yearling. Fantastic gelding, hip number 55, Noodles. Hip number 60, Tuxedo. This is a 2015 model black and white gelding. He's 14 two hands and 1,100 pounds. Uh, registered in the AQHA as Sons of Anarchy. This horse has been cool. Uh, we bought this horse over a year ago and I put Jack Steed on him. Uh, Jack hauled him all over the country from Canada literally to New Mexico. Uh, worked ranches on him doing different things. This horse has been absolutely fantastic. He spent the winter with Jack down in Texas working stockyards uh, and wheat pastures, and he has done it all. And he's been absolutely kind and gentle every inch of the way. Uh, I watched Jack run down yearling down in New Mexico last spring on this horse, and this yearling had no intentions of being caught, and Jack ran it across some awful rough country and finally got it roped. Uh, this horse never hesitated one time. That's hip number 60, Tuxedo. Hip number 61, Cowgirl. This is a 2016 model Chestnut Mare. She is 14 three hands and 1185 pounds. What a neat little horse, I really like her. She is registered in the AQHA as SCR Copper Gal. And what a cool mare. This is the horse Haley rode last summer the whole time we were 
over there in Utah doing the collegiate level road to the horse. This mare never made a mistake. Carrying the flags in, leading the colts in, doing her job, and that's the way she's been on the ranch. Uh, from work to play, she has done everything from carry protein tubs and bed rolls to GoPro camera sticks and tarps. She's done it all. She's been a ranch favorite. She will fit many different riding styles. This is a cool little mare with a great disposition. Hip number 61, cowgirl. Remember, for more complete footage on any of these horses as well as the hip numbers that aren't here in order, go to our website and check out the YouTube footage. At Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sales, we're proud to offer a 30-day satisfaction guarantee. For more information on that guarantee, check our website. Throughout history, a cowboy's horse has been there for more than just the miles. He's a partner in everything they do. Renowned trainer Ken McNabb invites you to find your perfect equine partner at this year's 14th annual Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sale, June 4th at the Powderhorn Ranch in Douglas, Wyoming. Each of the horses has been trained to handle all that the rugged Wyoming landscape can offer, making them a horse for every purpose and level of rider. Go to dmhorses.com for more details and videos. And don't miss this year's Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sale. Hip number 62, Badge. This is a 2014 model gelding. He is 14 three hands and 1,050 pounds. He is registered as Sugar Badger Starlight. I have had this horse, he's an eight year old. I bought this horse as a five year old. Uh, we have loved this horse. I bought him from the people who raised him, uh, broke him, started him. They are very good friends of mine. They train and show cutting horses on the West Coast up in Washington. Uh, this horse came to the ranch and went to work. He has never made a bad move, never done a bad thing. We finally, I told uh, Trent the other day, we have to sell him this year uh, and none of us want to because we absolutely love him. One really cowy, cool individual who's safe and kind and gentle and broke in every way that you would want one to be broke. And that's hip number 62, Badge. Hip number 64, Dollar. Dollar is a 2014 model bay gelding. He stands 15 three hands, 1,250 pounds, and is registered in the AQHA as Can You Belize It? Dollar is a very handsome bay gelding that we have really enjoyed. We ride Dollar on the ranch and he is very fun and enjoyable. He's sure-footed and goes anywhere you ask him. He trusts his rider and wants to please. Dollar is smooth and easy. He neck reins and works very well from leg and seat pressure. We have ridden him through the deepest snow drifts and water crossings. He is straight, correct, and super easy to look at. He loads and hauls great. He is good to saddle and will stand tied all day long. The Houck family have enjoyed this horse immensely. They're proud to bring him to you. That's tip number 64, Dollar. Hip number 65, Henry's a 2009 model chestnut gelding. He is great, he stands 15 hands, 1,200 pounds of big, pretty quarter horse gelding. He is one nice horse that is put together right. He's stout and built to last, good bone and feet with that excellent chestnut color. He's seen many miles and hours on the ranch. He's handy for any job that you need him to do, athletic and cowy when he's asked, but more than willing to walk around quiet and gentle down the trail. He'll go anywhere you point him with no hesitation. He's soft in the bridle, picks up his leads with ease, and lopes around level-headed and quiet. 
He spent two summers as a guest horse with White Mountain Outfitters in the Bighorn Mountains, and he is a super fun horse that's well broke with a great walk. That is hip number 65, Henry. Hip number 66, Apache. This is a 2015 model seven-year-old Appaloosa gelding. He stands 15 two hands, 1,225 pounds of the sweetest, kindest, gentlest horse I have ever owned in my life. When I bought this horse, I put him in the pen and after he'd had a quarantine period, I told the boys, I said, hey, we need to catch that uh, Apache horse. And Trent said, oh, dad, don't worry about him. He said, I've been going out, climbing up on the fence rail. He'll walk over and pick me up. I climb on him with nothing, and we ride around the pen just for fun. That is Apache. That describes him perfect. Any level of rider will get along with this horse. You could lay him off a day, a month, a week, year, 10 years. He would come back the greatest horse ever. The only problem with laying him off is you're not riding him. You're not enjoying him. This horse was born to be your best friend. He is so kind, so gentle, and such a good handle, so nice to ride. This is the kind of horse that we drive the wheels off our pickups looking for. An incredible gelding, hip number 66, Apache. Hip number 67, Jade. This is a 2014 model black mare. She is 14 three hands tall, 1,100 pounds, registered as Reba Jane Valentine. Sweet, responsive, and handy as can be, Jade greets you at the gate ready to go. She's fun to ride out by herself or in a group and will walk, trot, or lope in any direction you choose. Her cowy, confident work ethic make her a favorite for pasture work or sorting. She's point and go in rugged terrain. Jane has an awesome neck rein and stops off of woe at all gates. She's intelligent and enjoyable to ride, has a soft, slow jog that is easy to set, and gets a gait with a one-handed side pass. She doesn't complain if you hop her on the trailer in the morning and don't get back home until after dark. Pick you up at the mounting block, make your life easier. She's straightforward, practical, and cute. That is hip number 67, Jade. Hip number 68, Mr. Shorty. He is 14 two hands and every bit of 1,100 pounds. He's registered in the AQHA as Doc's Raider Hancock. This is a horse we've had for the last four or five years. He's been Trent's personal horse. He's used him in rodeos all around the country, heeled on him, uh, breakaway roped on him, tied down calves on him, used him all over the ranch. He has laid this horse off for months uh, while he rode other horses and came back to him and gave him an hour's warning and hauled him to a rodeo. This horse has never made a mistake. If you've got a young person or a lady looking for a breakaway horse uh, or a young person looking for a breakaway or a tie down horse, a heel horse, this horse is ready to go. If uh, you're an older roper, uh, that is looking for a horse to haul you on, on the heel side and have fun. This horse has been there, done that. He'll make the corner and stop hard. We absolutely love this horse uh, in every way possible. This is a really cool horse. Hip number 68, Mr. Shorty. Hip number 70, Trixie. Trixie's a 2005 model of Sorrel mare. She's great. I'm so proud of this mare. Uh, I'm even more proud of Tinley Hatfield, who has been riding this horse for me. Her dad does most of the riding, but Tinley takes this horse and shows her at the local events and has fun on her. 
Uh, she is kind and gentle for anybody. If you have a young rider who needs an easy, gentle ride, then Trixie's that horse. If you have a young rider who needs a, a horse to go run the barrel pattern on, then Trixie is that horse. If you're an older person who needs that same horse, Trixie can be that horse as well. A very kind, gentle mare who has done everything we've asked of her uh, and been perfect in every way. That is hip number 70, Trixie. Hip number 71, Trooper, 2014 model bay gelding, 15 one hands, 1,250 pounds. Trooper is one cool bay gelding. He will meet you at the gate to be caught. He's very sweet and has such an enjoyable personality. He's soft in the bridle, side passes, and lopes around quiet and level-headed. He's good to bathe, clip, and load in any trailer and is awesome for the farrier. He's been ridden all over the ranch, gathering and sorting cattle, crossing creeks, up and down the mountains. Wherever you point him through thick brush or thin, he'll go without hesitation. That is hip number 71, Trooper. Hip number 73, Baron is a 2010 model Brown Tobiano Gelding. He stands 15 one hands, 1180 pounds, and is a grade gelding. Baron is an eye catching paint with a solid way of going and liking for the trail. He enjoys riding over the next hill as much as we do and has unabashedly climbed, crossed, or gone through whatever we steered him towards. Baron has led pack horses, Ben packed himself, and pulled the calf sled all winter. He's solid with obstacles, rides bareback or in the saddle. One of the best things about him is what you see is what you get. After a vacation, we just saddle up and ride away. He's tolerant and steady, but not asleep on his feet, and is happiest when you point him somewhere and give him something to do. This is an all-around good fellow who's the right age and experience to suit a variety of people. That is hip number 73, Baron. Number 75, Summit. This is a 2010 model Grula Gelding. We've used Summit to wrangle herds of horses on the ranch, carry flags in the pasture, trusted him with young riders. He'll cross water, ride bareback or English. He'll handle trail obstacles quietly and passionately. He's got a good ground cover and trot and a slow, smooth lope that is fun and easy to ride. Summit loves attention and will seek you out in the pasture to embark on any adventure you have in mind. He is one of those hard to find good gentle geldings with a gorgeous color, kind eye, and experience to make every ride an enjoyable one. That is hip number 75, Summit. Hip number 76, Eli. This is a 2018 model four-year-old red dun gelding. He stands 15 hands and 1,100 pounds and is registered as LXH Cutters Eli. Eli is a nice young gelding that has a solid ranch start. He's eager to please and has an easy way of traveling that is a joy to ride. Eli was used for calving this spring and has been used on our ranch for the last year. He packed elk out of the Badlands and handled the rough terrain with ease. He is gentle every day and is ready to continue on his education in whatever discipline you choose to take him in. That is hip number 76, Eli. Hip number 77, Jazzy. This is a 2017 model gray gelding, 14 three hands, 1,100 pounds of gorgeous horse, registered as SF Jazzy Ray in the AQHA. Handsome, classy, and, com and a complete gentleman, you will fall head over heels with your sweet boy, Jazzy. 
He's a people pleaser and athletic, willing to perform any task. Jazzy checks all the boxes of being cowboy cool. He's as honest as they come and the perfect choice for the whole family. His gentle soul, willing mind, and kind-hearted personality fulfills every need. He has a smooth lope, soft sliding stops, and controlled turns. Makes him so simple to operate. There is no holding him back from a successful life of ranching, roping, or trail riding. Ranch riding, ranch versatility, or all the above. Let him be a handsome yard ornament for a few weeks. Saddle up and he is game. This gelding is a gem and makes it easy to be a cowboy and enjoy life along the trail. That is hip number 77, Jazzy. Tip number 78, Patches. Uh, this is a really neat horse. He's a 2013 model nine-year-old paint gelding. I bought him from the man that started him and had him his whole life, uh, and he has not disappointed us. If you want to get to the top of the mountain and have fun doing it, point Patches that way and away you go. I hauled him to a branding the other day, and he absolutely was the best horse at the branding, hands down, no doubt about it, not just me saying that, everybody else. I drug calf after calf after calf on this horse, uh, literally drug 50 calves on him before I quit, and he was absolutely faultless every inch of the way. He has been a really cool horse for us, quiet, kind and gentle, nice one-handed neck rein, soft and gentle, absolute good horse. That's hip number 78, Patches. Hip number 79, Comanche is a 2015 model Bayron Tobiano Gelding. He stands 15 two hands and 1190 pounds of gorgeous grade paint gelding. Comanche is very willing and dependable. He is a solid ride outsider in the arena, has seen many hours of trail riding and gathering cows. He rides very well alone and has been solid after time off. He is my pick for long days because he is not in a fool's hurry but enjoys covering country, won't see any job through without feeling sorry for himself, has an incredible long country covering stride when you ask for it and will go all day, but still have heart and be game when you turn for home. He also has a smooth lope that is easy to sit for miles. Comanche has a good head on his shoulders and has pulled the sled, gone through the obstacles, over the snow drifts, anywhere you want to do. He's been quiet with newborn pairs, handles them with ease, he isn't bothered by much. That is hip number 79, Comanche. Hip number 80, Newt. This is a 2018 model gray four-year-old gelding. He stands 15 two hands and 1,200 pounds. I love this gelding because he has a 10-year-old mind and a four-year-old body. He is so quiet, so gentle. This is one of those horses that I tell people was born broke. Uh, kid horses aren't made, they're born. And that's this horse right here. He is a four-year-old with all the quiet disposition and gentleness of a horse three times his age. He has done everything on the ranch you could ask him to do, uh, from uh, fool around 
in the arena to dragging calves to the branding fire. No matter what you ask him to do, he's been there, he's done that, and has won. Cool, cool gelding. Very proud to bring you this horse. He is 15 two hands, 1,200 pounds, and is registered in the American Paint Horse Association. Again, that's hip number 80, Newt. Hip number 81, Fitz. Fitz is a 2012 model brown gelding, solid in every meaning of the word. He is 15 three hands and 1,360 pounds of really pretty gelding. Uh, this is a big brown horse that is as cool as they come. Fitz has a big gentle hearted nature that is easy to like. He is confident and steady on the trail, crossing ditches, creeks, snow drifts, steep terrain without batting an eye. He did not think twice about going through any of the obstacles we created and has a nice easy gait inside and out. Fritz rides on a loose rein and has spent plenty of time gathering pastures and pleasure riding. Last summer we took him swimming bareback in the pond and I wish you could have seen how accommodating he was with the utter ridiculousness of what was going on on his back. He waded out into the water and had just as much fun as everybody else. That's hip number 81, Fitz. Hip number 82, Texas. This is a 2016 model Bay and White paint. He has 14 two hands and a thousand pounds of grade paint gelding. Hey y'all, my name is Texas and I'm looking for a new rider. I'm a laid back gelding that has had a lot of different experiences. I love feeling the wind blow through my mane when I'm racing to deliver mail as part of the Pony Express re-ride. It was fun hearing the kids giggle on my back during camp last year. As they learned to ride, I was a patient teacher to even the beginner riders. I like stretching my legs out on the trail and I have packed in the mountains. I am great at obstacles like carrying flags, crossing water, dragging tarps, crossing the teeter-totter, and kicking the large ball. I've chased cows, gone swimming, and been ridden bareback and double anywhere you want to go. That is hip number 82, Texas. Hip number 83, Strider. This is a 2017 model Bay Gelding. He is 15 one hands, 1,050 pounds, registered as KS Zip and Dash in the AQHA. Strider's without doubt an exceptionally quiet, gentle-natured, easy-going horse. He's very smooth and easy to ride. We have ridden Strider on the ranch and in the arena, down the trails. He is very talented. Strider works well from your legs and seat as well as having a great neck rein and responsive to the bridle. We've worked him on the ranch and he's sure-footed in rough country. Crosses all obstacles without hesitation. Uh, doesn't mind traffic or dogs or any other obstacles. There's no problem for Strider. He saddles up good every single time. That's hip number 83, Strider. Hip number 84, Joe, 2009 Sorrel Gelding. This is a 15 two hand, 1250 pound gelding, registered as CA Smoking Joe in the AQHA. 
His theme song should be Good Old Boys because that is just exactly what he is. He's a good old boy. He's quiet and gentle with a lot of handle. Uh, he's been used all over the ranch. I've put inexperienced riders on him uh, to go out and do jobs that required experienced people. And Joe just took them along and helped them do their job. He is a fantastic gelding in a big chestnut, pretty version, 15 two hands, 1,250 pounds of really cool individual. That's hip number 84, Joe. Hip number 85, Cowpoke. This is a 2012 model Bay Gelding. He stands 15 one hands, 1,225 pounds. He's registered in the AQHA as Porath Pat. Ah, what a cool looking gelding. He's solid and honest. Cowpoke's what we call uh, the right kind. He's a been there, done that fellow who we feel takes new things in stride and wants to treat you right. Cowpoke is dependable to saddle up for a trail ride, trip to town, or a long day on the ranch. He's straightforward and practical and goes where you're pointing without complaining. This guy is good with time off, gentle without being lazy. He's done a great job with our obstacle course, good with traffic, and is comfortable on the ranch, trail, or in the arena. Cowpoke will fit a wide variety of riders and lifestyles. We are confident that just about anybody will like him as much as we do. That is hip number 85, Cowpoke. Remember, for more complete footage on any of these horses, as well as the hip numbers that aren't here in order, go to our website and check out the YouTube footage. At Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sales, we're proud to offer a 30-day satisfaction guarantee. For more information on that guarantee, check our website. Throughout history, a cowboy's horse has been there for more than just the miles. He's a partner in everything they do. Renowned trainer Ken McNabb invites you to find your perfect equine partner at this year's 14th annual Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sale, June 4th at the Powderhorn Ranch in Douglas, Wyoming. Each of the horses has been trained to handle all that the rugged Wyoming landscape can offer, making them a horse for every purpose and level of rider. Go to dmhorses.com for more details and videos. And don't miss this year's Diamond McNabb Ranch Horse Sale. Remember, if you've got questions, call me right away. I want to talk to you about those horses, answer your questions. If you want to join us in person, you can watch it online at dvauction.com. You can go to our website, diamondmcnabbranchhorses.com, for YouTube links to a lot more uh, in-depth video on these horses. We have as much information as we can possibly push at you. So if you've got questions, give me a holler. I love to talk horses. Until next time, May God bless the trails you ride. Gonna take a ride on one true.